thought this morning we could, well, I could get ready and chat about all kinds of stuff. I was thinking about everything I wanted to talk about last night and now I have to like remember what I was gonna talk about because I do not remember. But give me a second, I'm sure. This thing is like one of the best inventions of all time because there's nothing worse than cold coffee when it's freezing cold. This morning it is 30 degrees, feels like 23. So, love that for me. I forgot what I was gonna talk about. I know this is like not an original thought, obviously, but weekends are not long enough. literally at all today um, it's almost 12 hours later more than 12 hours later whoops and do I still not remember what I talked what I was gonna talk about no sorry it is dark but my beautiful plants are my light <laughs> if you watch TikTok, maybe you'll know what I'm talking about but you know that trend that went around that was like watch my kid like react to whatever and it was like it was actually flipped around towards them you know what I'm saying that's me with these plants I'm like my little baby plants I love them this is dill and it's like going wild this is Thai basil regular basil parsley back there is thyme I don't even like thyme so I don't really care but my mint my favorite herb of all time is not growing does anybody else like reset your house every night before you go to bed because I do and if I don't whoa honestly I don't even know what happened because I don't not reset sometimes I don't do the dishes but for the most part I have to hello hello I did not work again today I finished my fourth book of the year which is like shocking to me because I only read 12 books last year no I read like 18 books last year but my goal was to read 12 books this year. My goal is to read 24 books. But I'm already on my fifth book. What the heck? So, I'm reading another holiday book because if you remember a couple vlogs, it's not a couple vlogs, it must have been a long time ago. I ordered like eight different holiday, like Christmas books. And this is one that everybody was talking about on TikTok whenever I looked up like holiday books. I've heard this one is great, so I'm gonna start this now. I just finished the Bridgerton number four last night, and I'm not gonna lie, I was a little disappointed, but no spoilers here. But if you wanna talk about it, let me know. <laughs> Good morning, my people. Today, I don't work until later on in the day, so I am trying to get my gym stuff done before because going to the gym after work is like, torture but I want to do something cuter with my hair today I feel like I always just do like either low pony or like a bun or something I did these cute little buns and I liked it a lot so let's try it maybe it's just my gym on post but like I never want to look cute <laughs> going to that gym because I feel like people just I don't know Military gyms low-key are really intimidating because people just Like that stereotypical people stare at the gym. It's like times a hundred At military gyms. I don't know. Okay <laughs> uh, Not as cute as I want it to be. I don't know. Maybe it's just me if you go if you live on a military base and you go to the gym um, It's just different. It's not like off-post gyms like, it's a lot of, like, very serious people working out at the gym. So, I tend to just kind of try to be a fly on the wall as much as possible. I feel like from the back, it looks probably bad. What does it look like? 
I don't know. <laughs> I'm literally not gonna watch this footage until I edit it, so I don't even know why I looked at it, but maybe I need to redo this one too now. Oh girl, no ma'am. I look bald in the back. Who's gonna tell me that I look bald? I was about to go to the gym looking like this and I'm, I look bald. Why do I look bald? Am I balding? Oh no, oh no. Okay, I decided on this little braid. Can you see it? Tiny little braid. Um, because I don't know what else to do and I did a bun just to get it out of my face and like get it out of my neck space. Alright, I'm ready. I have a little braid again. I feel like I'm like back in high school trying to do the braids. Whatever, the back of my hair looks awful. But I'm only gonna be at work for like literally a couple hours, so it doesn't really matter. I'm off. See you in a couple hours. Hopefully I'll remember to keep vlogging. Done, did it. I'm in such a good mood today. Anyways, wish every day was like that. This ponytail, you can't even see it because it's dark back there, but I feel like from the back, don't judge me, because I know you are. From the back, my hair just looks... I have calyx back here on the back of my head, and when I haven't washed my hair in like three days, they like to make a fun appearance. If it doesn't look that bad from this side, then BAM! You can't even see it because, <laughs> look at this. What is that? It's only 1.40, it's 1, 2 o'clock. <laughs> Uh, 2.02 and I am going to put comfy clothes on but look how cute my shoes are Jake got them for me for Christmas and I've been wearing them to work because I exclusively wear white sneakers now it's my thing I really need somebody who's around all the time so that whenever I talk to myself I'm not talking to myself that's what Jake's for he listens even if he's not listening I'm talking to someone, not to myself. But I'm talking to you guys, so, you know, it's not that bad. Here I am under my counter yet again. Um, don't mind my half out braid. I took it down to go on a walk and put a beanie on. But you don't care. Um, so there's this thing that was going around on TikTok. I spend too much time on TikTok. We don't need to talk about it. Don't mention it. It's fine. And one of the little, like, trends or whatever was talking about being an ingredient kid... And essentially, it's like your family never had like snacks or like things like that. You just like ate ingredients. So you're like an ingredient household. And one way to know that you're an ingredient kid is for a snack, you eat croutons. I will not be explaining further. P.S. I don't feel like cooking dinner. I cannot be bothered. I feel like I never share my nighttime routine with you guys. I feel like it's kind of boring, but I'm also somebody that thinks all of my vlogs are boring. I did the dishes and we, the light is so bright. These are my dishes. We do not use our dishwasher because, especially when he's not here, I don't need to. But I have not used it since September of 2020. I have run it a couple times just to like, I don't know, clean it. <laughs> It's literally brand new. I just don't, I don't like it. It's not convenient for me. So I just do my dishes every night. I wipe down everything and nothing is better than waking up to a clean kitchen. So now I'm gonna go around the house and kind of put stuff away before I head over to settle down for bed. Normally I would just turn this light off and this light off but it doesn't really make a difference. <laughs> so I have recently been turning this light off as well. Look at these babies. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? How beautiful. Later in the night, like after I shower and everything, I'm gonna turn, I'm gonna go over here and turn this off because you can like press it and it'll turn off. But apparently I'm supposed to leave it on there for 17 hours during the day. It's a long time. 
Doors locked. Check. Lights off. Check. Oh shoot, I gotta fill my water bottle one more time. Why does this keep happening to me? Oh shoot, I tightened it. Okay. I do not wash my face outside of the shower. But this is the best face wash ever. You have to get the one that removes makeup because the other one, this one is like cream to foam. Get this one, it's worth it. And it gets all my makeup off. I've only had one other face wash actually remove my makeup and it was the Philosophy I'll put it right here, I don't know. But it's way more expensive than that one, so I just got that one, and it has the foaminess, which is nice. I really like it. should not be making this video <laughs> but it was 10 28 and I had just finished reading I put my book down and I went to check my phone because I was gonna put in like the number the page numbers and everything I opened my phone and I see Instagram messages and text messages and Jake texted me <laughs> He didn't even call me. I was like, why didn't you FaceTime me? He made the list to be a warrant officer. And when I tell you guys, this is, I could explain this tomorrow and just leave this here. <laughs> but when I tell you that this man has been talking about being a 140 Alpha warrant officer, Literally since the day we got together. I'm not even kidding you. I've known him for a very long time But like as soon as we started talking and dating He was like I knew when we got married. I knew when we started dating this man would be a 140 alpha so It's just so crazy. It's literally been Oh My gosh, we started dating almost six years ago and I've known him, like we were talking about this, I know we were talking about this, as friends, just like catching up in 2016. So literally seven years ago, and he's been in the army for almost eight years. <laughs> so like almost the entire time he's been in the army, he's been wanting this, so I'm just like so excited. And this is my true form of finding out. Um, I can't believe it. He just texted me and said, um, and then sent me the picture. <laughs> Ugh, oh, that's so crazy. I should be asleep. I can't go to sleep now though. How am I supposed to go to sleep? I literally was like, book down, ready to put my head to the pillow. And I look over at my phone and it's like the biggest news. We've been waiting for this news. I can't go to sleep. How am I supposed to go to sleep? <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> I'm headed to the commissary. I need to get some flour. I'm out of eggs and cucumbers. So I need to go get those things, but I probably won't get eggs at the commissary because every time I do, they're just not, I don't know why, they're just not good. But look at my hair. I did, decided to do little braids on the side and I think it looks kind of funky if I just like leave it like that. So I'm just tucking it behind. And I think it's cute. So, I don't feel like putting makeup on. So, this will have to do. Put some effort in, right? Yeah. Alright. 
let's head to the commissary. I have been taking my Stanley to the gym with me because it's how I'm tracking my water is by like three Stanley cups. So like three, almost a little over three liters of like water every day. And I just don't feel like trying to, in my head, calculate, okay, how much of this do I need to drink to make it like a half if I bring a blender bottle, whatever. So I've just been bringing this with me and I feel like people look at me like I'm crazy. But I kind of want another one of these because it's my tried and true. Also, I've been seeing so many people on TikTok put soda in here <clears throat> and coffee in here. I feel like people who do that are going to judge me for saying this, but that's so much soda. Like filling this up with soda, I just can't even imagine. Which like props to you. I'm not saying it's unhealthy. I'm just saying like I don't think I could drink that much. Water, check. Yaka, check. sourdough starter holy toledos okay maybe don't overflow okay love ya thanks for being so active but please don't overflow okay, i gotta make some bread today yeah. 